What's up guys, it's me Gemma and we'll do a trailer reaction and review for Green Band Trailer Suicide Squad. I've been hearing there's been some noise about it. Let's check it out. Super villains. Sad souls in costumes. Wanting you to think they're all dark and deep. What's it like? Living life as a punchline. But all it would take would be one blessed act of rebellion. For you to restore your dignity in its entirety. You know the deal. Complete the mission, you get 10 years off your sentence. You fail to follow my orders in any way, and I detonate the explosive device in the base of your skull. Love him or hate him, these are your brothers and sisters for the next few days. Any questions? Yes, that is your hand. Very good. We're all gonna die. I hope so. Oh, for God's sake. Na, na, na. Hey, hey, hey. You. Oh, man. This is gonna be fun. Suicide. Well, that's kind of our thing. Oh my god, what's that? Nothing like a bloodbath to start the day. They call you Peacemaker? Who is she? I cherish peace with all my heart. I don't care how many men, women, and children I need to kill to get it. I thought you were the crazy one. I oh, am. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> This is just madness. Here's the deal. We failed the mission. You die. If we find out any information you give us is false, you die. You if die. If we find out you have personalized license plates, you die. What? No. Mm -hmm. This is gonna be a whole lot of fun, really. This is like Guardians of the Galaxy type of fun. Um, yeah, this is actually a pretty good trailer. Um, I don't know if this is better than like the Red Band one because that was also crazy. But this one has funny. It has more what's going to happen. It's more fun. It's going. It's more James Gunn as well. So very good trailer. Got to get to see more of like more of the characters. Margot Robbie, she's Harley Quinn. I, I've been hoping that she was Harley Quinn when she, before she got casted in the first Suicide Squad. And this is just basically dream casting. Um, the guy called Joe Kinnaman, he has um, Rick Flag. He's actually pretty good. Like, he's actually more improved. I think he has more of a handle of that character. Looks like it. Hope he doesn't get, like, go, go to the, little, like, the back end, like the first movie. He just elbow looks like he's, he's been very charismatic in his film, so it's like it's gonna be it's gonna be a joy to watch. Um, the guy who played the, the, the one of like um guys from Arkham in um, the Dark Knight and one of uh, Scotland's friends in um, Ant Man, he's gonna he's gonna be interesting. To see his powers. I think he's called a polka dot man. Very very good. Uh, John Cena looks like he's taking he's got he's making it campy fun. So it's gonna be he's gonna see if he's gonna be funny to see how he plays out. Another wrestler that James Gunn's directing, but it looks like he's I think he does well with wrestlers. Like Batista's like done fantastic since he cast him in Guardians. Um Yeah, Val Davis, she's the boss. I think she's per almost perfect for that man the waller. Hopefully she has much more things to do in like they have this, like it looks like it has more stakes because the first one didn't have any, didn't really have stakes at all, really. So I hope they bring out the these guys are actually bad guys, really. Like not a bunch of misfits, just bad guys, just wanting to do something for their selfish needs. Because that's what I didn't feel like with the first Suicide Squad. But looks like James Gunn is gone loose on this trailer at film and. Yeah, the green band looks looks better than the red band, and we have to, we have to get to see Starro at the end. And only James Gunn can put out a bizarre 
character and put into real life and see how it goes. Anyway, that's my reaction and review for Suicide Squad. Rebellion trailer. Click like and subscribe. Leave a comment in the comment section. And this is Jeremiah. Peace.